It's been a clear throughout ETSU's offseason program. The Gardner-Webb freshman All-American transfer Jalen King will be the guy under center for the Bucks this season when it begins. But when the Blue and Gold stepped out for preseason camp this past week, the competitive QB2 Cole Doyle was notably absent. Head coach Trey Lamb confirmed he is no longer with the team, calling it, quote, his decision, referring to Doyle. Lamb minced no words in the spring. He praised the graduate transfer's playmaking ability. Without Doyle in the picture now, the cupboard is far from bare, especially with transfer Geno English in the mix. There's a reason we got five on scholarship now. I mean, we got five full scholarship quarterbacks. One of them's going to go play, and then we're going to have great backups. Geno's played a lot of football, Florida State, Gardner-Webb, and then here, and he's, he's won games for us. So I've got no problem with Geno coming in and competing with Jalen. And we got Steven Johnson from Charlotte. He played plays at Charlotte, you know, at a Division I school at quarterback. So we got plenty of depth there. Um, maybe a blessing in disguise when it's all done because some of these young freshmen are going to be able to get the reps that Cole was getting. Baylor Hayes from Brentwood, Tennessee, and Reese Fountain from Rome, Georgia, the two freshman signal callers recruited by Lamb and his staff this offseason.